Well, what? Oh, what is all you guys? Welcome back to Everything Import, Import, my dear man, all right? So for today, it's going to be from Bath and Body Works, and this is their fragrance mist. New scent, as well as a uh, repeated scent only, new packaging. Most of it is um online exclusive. For today, I didn't want to do um, the Dove, you know, Dove release some new scent, but came in and saw that these retailers was like, you know what, I'm going to go right ahead and do the Bath and Body Works. If I sound tired, it's because I am. Walk straight in, start spraying, play around with it, and I try figuring out what goes with what and what is what. So before we go any further, I'm going to start off with the Tutti Fruity Candle. You bought candle, Jesus, I'm praying. <laughs> Tutti Fruity Candy, forgive me. Packaging and fun. That is why I purchased it. I already have it from last year, which is the Happy Easter Tutti Fruity Candy, but packaging, this should have been the packaging from day one. Absolutely love the love it, love the font, love the way them do the candy with the little, like this is just ah, so, so good. So it's actually the same note, which is a sweet jelly beans, mixed berries, and sugared lemon. But this for me, again, remember when you come on to fragrances or sense of scent is different, I might pick up on something and somebody else might pick up on something else. Most of us goes for the top note, some of us get the middle, some of us get the base, and some of us get everything into one. Now with the new one, aside from me loving the packaging for this one, for me, it's more on the sour side, but it's not a bad sour. It's a good sour. This is sweet and sour, but you get that more sourness and the jelly bean is coated in the sugar. So think of um the sour patches and you can smell that sweet is sour. So can you call that like a sour sweet? Yeah. So I get more of the sourness. So the lemon don't come off as zesty, but more of sour. And I brought down the first one. So this is the first one. It's at the Happy Easter. This is more sweet. Like the packaging, it just may you know, look bad and but I reckon them because something and the color light just blue again. For me, this one is more on the sweet side, and then that one is on the sour side. So I'm glad I'm gonna pick it up aside from the packaging. I'm like, eh, I'm soon. This is really, really good. Tutti Fruity, really, really good. Then the newest scent, which is the Coco Paradise. As my straight packaging really nice, just simple and nice. You know, we're going into summer, so we'll see the palm trees that come out. We we'll suggest the the beach, the breeze, the coolness. It just I suggest summer, right? But aside from that, when my first spray, the first thing come to mind is uh Victoria's Secret Pink Bronzed Coconut. Like as my spray, I was like, oh my god, why does it smell like bronzed coconut? That creamy coconut note. So for this, it's salted coconut manui, sugar neroli, if I'm pronouncing these words correctly, and bronze sandalwood. So this gives you that warm tropical vibe, like I said, it is creamy. When you say bronze coconut, just think of the coconut being toasted. But immediately, so if you don't even get your hands on this, and you already have the bronze coconut from Victoria's Secret, actually bring it downstairs too, but let's pick up the small one, like... Bam. Like, if you have it, try it for yourself and then tell me. Like, the note for this is toasted coconut, dreamy, some beans, and a next, um, a next salty noise. It smells, this and this, to me, is like, just the same. Again, like, get that like a coconut vibe thing to it. Now, let's get into the, what, what a collection here? Is this the tropical collection? Should be a shame of myself. I did not pick up the um, the pink pineapple. Again, my habit. I have two of it because I bought it when it just landed. And I bought it in SA. It sounds like I don't need it again. Even though it's a pink, nice packaging. That's the only reason why I wasn't like... If I never had a backup, I would have picked up the pink pineapple into the fragrance. Miss again, but I wasn't needed. I did not get the coconut pineapple when they first released it. And I wanted to get my hands on it because I have the body wash that is called Poolside. It was um for 2021. It's a, it's a pick up the Poolside, but I actually pick up four of that. That smells so good. I was like, oh my God, I don't have the coconut pineapple to go with that pina colada vibes. 
So the note for this is shaved coconut, fresh pineapple, and sugar cane. Again, it's like a fruity. It's not like a, it is fruity, but it's almost like a pineapple smoothie served inside of a coconut. Like that's what I get from it. Really, really nice. You get your coconut, you get a pineapple, and it's in fact a juicy pineapple. So yes, yeah, smell good and straight up tropical, like a virgin pina colada. Or probably if them they put like mint into it, or like most of the note in the in the watermelon what them called pink rump, or even a little like a little um bourbon, like a little alcohol into it. If you eat a little alcohol, then you know, look a ump it up, look a bit more. So then this out of the set, we can't see good. Come on, if you pick up on it. Hope it's not too close. But this, which is the fr fresh jungle rain, this is my absolute favorite. My absolute, absolute favorite. I never know, but I really love this one like this. I love it. All right, so for this, it is rain kissed palms, Amazon dragon fruit, and misty breeze. It's just a refreshing tropical ah cool you know but for me when i smell this let me tell you something this is how i know that i'm getting back into my fragrances the first thing come to mind was the um sea the salt water breeze for salt water breeze oh you know it is fresh and it is salty for is this because it's the dragon fruit it's like a fruity fresh clean breeze that makes sense what may I describe it to you if you own the sea salt breeze, you know that saltiness, you can tell it's, you really get that little ocean breeze vibes. It's the same thing for this, but because of the fruit into it. So instead of a salty breeze, it's a fruity breeze. And it's not an overbearing sweet. It's like you still get that freshness, that coolness. You still know that. Uh, it have a little, you just have that little... Like that's so the rainforest is like really the rain of fall thing and you're not at the bee but you're really inside of the rain. Just think of when the rain of the fall and the place just get clouded and the water just support them playing and the earth, the earth Nissan. I I never knew I would love this one. So I love it. I love it. I never knew you could get actually a fruity breeze scent. So that is what this is. I love the dragon fruit in it. It's really, really nice. Then we have coconut mango lagoon again this reminds me of the tree hot peach sorbet uh the note for this is the um, sunny mango salt water woods and coral blue no coral when i think of coral you know coral is peach so i was like what is coral blooms and it's like something into the sea i don't know what the peach coral and bleach just correlate it doesn't say peach but i am getting peach so when i first spray it i'm getting like a green salted mango and then it meets a juicy peach but then when it dries down on my skin i'm getting this nice powdery mango peach and it's it's like it's like mango meat peach. I don't know if it's my mind, but I'm getting straight up peach, like <laughs> peach, and I love it. It's so peachy. <laughs> you know, you do you know it's mango, but if again, try it for yourself and see that coral thing. It's just a juicy peach and mango. I like it. Then last but not least is the watermelon mojito, mojito, mojito. If I'm pronouncing it correct. For this, we have the watermelon and soda, pink rum, and cane sugar. Again, when I smell this, first thing coming to mind, um, Target. What a brand in a Target name is Beloved or something like Love and Planet. But you know, the Beloved, the Beloved of a watermelon, mojito, and mint. That's the name. It's supposed to I have it too. That's what it smells like. So for the pink rum, I think the pink rum would be like the mint. It smells exactly like this. Like, again, try it for yourself. The beloved brand. As a matter of fact, just give me one quick minute. I'm going to get it. I'm going to cut the video and I'm going to get it. Just give me one quick minute. Ah, thank you for your patience. So here it is. Like, love, beauty, and planet are beloved to this and this. So these two. Again, it's the same thing. So, this is for is it nine ninety nine or seven nine? I think this is nine ninety nine. You know, bottom, but I work with for them seventeen. Everything raised to sixteen, 
so for this one this is 16 16.95 so smell just like this so yeah that completes it for today video um next video coming up it's gonna be if me don't do the dove I still have more stuff from um Basam Body Works but I try my best to keep up with the consistency and thank you once again for your continuous support and I'll catch you guys into the next if you can get anything get your hands get your hands on this thank me later <laughs> alright <laughs> you, you bye bye